The team captains of the Spirit are there to guide and oversee the teams. They all bring their unique personalities and expertise to the event. And Scotland's captain had a lion's share of both. And I'm standing here with Lisa. Lisa. And I've got one question for you. Go for right. it. Will you marry me? Of course. See, there you go. My job's done, you know. I've come all this way to America to meet some beautiful women, right? And He's a flatterer. And my life has just been fulfilled. After the unofficial proposal, we got to learn more about Team Scotland. My name is Ian Ray and I'm the captain of the Scottish team. Is this the first time you've captained? No, this is the second time. The first time was in 2003. Why do you love it so much? I've been into golf for a long time. I started playing golf when I was eight years old because of my dad and, uh, and because I was bored. So I took up golf and it's been a long time since. How did you get into captaining a spirit team this year? I got into the team because I work for the Scottish Golf Union. I'm the national coach, so I go to quite a lot of the different events. We've sent other coaches to this fine event so that they can gain experience the same as me. So it was just my turn to come back after 10 years. Strategy, now that it's been 10 years and you've had a lot of time to prepare and plan for your new team, what's your new strategy to take home the gold, Ian? Well, I have been thinking about this for 10 years when my time comes to come back to this wonderful place and the course is fantastic and we have got two great drivers of the ball so once we are in the middle of the fairway we're just going to aim at the flag and make birdies all day long and that's how we're going to take home the gold. Introduce me to your team. The team is the, the two men we have Grant Forrest and Ewan Scott and the ladies we have Gemma Driver and Rachel Wharton. And what are some of your secret weapons within that team? What do they do really well? Well, they all play great. They all drive the ball really well. So in this course, you know, big long golf course, you've got to drive it good to put yourself in position to hit irons close at the green. And one of the strategies that the guys have been working on is make sure that they're up all the time. Any last things about the spirit, your takeaways from this week and just being here with all of the international teams there? I think there's so many great players, there's so many friendly guys, it's good to meet up with some of the coaches and the captains that I haven't seen for a good while and the camaraderie between everybody is wonderful and I think the, the people from the spirit make that happen. I think that's the whole thing about the event. So it, it makes it easy for, for everybody and it's just it's such a great week, the course is fantastic, you, you're just not going to get a better golf course than this and you know the hospitality from everybody at the golf club, the organisers over at the camp, it's fantastic. So there's no reason why anybody doesn't enjoy this week.